One of the new solutions that we've added into Enroute is a feed rate calculator to assist with determining the feed rate for a specific type of tool in a specific material. To show an example of how we would use this, let's, let's have a, a, an example job in mind and we'll say we're going to cut out some 0.75 MDF. Uh, what we're going to use is a 3 h inch compression spiral. So let's go to the, the information or the area for this particular tool and uh, I'm going to enter a, a page number here that will show us a little bit of information about this tool and, and here's a, a few different tools we might select. Um, we're going to, for this example, say we're going to use a, a double flute solid carbide compression bit. So this is a, a bit of a 60 and 100 DE. So this is a compression dev designed for fast feed rates and fit edge finishes. And uh, here we, we've got a few different part sizes. We're going to have a 3 h inch bit in mind. And we see by definition this has a double flute. Uh, there are some tools where you can choose between a single, double, or, or triple flute. But for this specific tool, it just comes as a double flute. All right, so now, uh, now that we know our tool, let's go look up a little bit about the tool information here. And uh, if we zoom in here a little bit, we'll see for this specific tool, 60 by 100 DE, they're recommending for one times the diameter a feed rate or a chip rate for the 3H inch tool of 0 0.014 to 0 0.016. So this is going to be if we cut to a depth of, that equals the diameter, which is 0.375. Uh, if we look up here, it'll tell us if we're going to double this, we might want to reduce this by about 25%. So that's one of the variables we're going to keep in mind. Now well, getting back now to our, our feed rate calculator. If we have a chip load of 0.014 at the lower end, and this is going to be in inches, we go an RPM of 18,000 RPMs, and we have two flutes here, we can calculate for inches per minute, and there's a few other variables here, but inches per minute, we would have a recommended feed rate of 504 inches. So this is going to uh, give us some information. Now, if we wanted to go to the higher end of the, the recommended chip load values, we could go up to 576. Uh, if we wanted to decrease and even increase our our RPMs, we could we could increase our feed rate a little bit. But keeping in mind, if we're going to double the diameter in terms of cut depth, we would need to reduce this by 0.5 or or by 20 percent. So uh, we would reduce in this case by about 140. So we'd go about 540 inches per minute to stay at the, with the, with the recommended feed rate of this particular tool manufacturer. So uh, using your chip load values, RPMs, and the number of flutes, you can get a good recommended feed rate. And this is based upon the specific information of the tool provided by the tool manufacturer. But it's a handy way to access a feed rate calculator and, and enter this information and get a, a, a recommended feed rate.